In this set of questions, we're going to look at the cost of college. We're going to calculate how much college costs over a set amount of years. We're also going to look at the different ways to pay for college, including savings, student loans, scholarships. We're going to look at how those things affect uh, the total amount of money you have to pay. So let's read this question and then break it down. It says, Pablo wants to attend UC Berkeley. One year at UC Berkeley costs $30,000. So over here in the total costs, I know it's going to be $30,000 per year. Okay, I'm just getting the number from here. He currently has $6,000 in savings. Okay, so here's the way to think about that. He has $6,000 in savings. That can be used once. Once he uses the savings, it's gone, right? So I'm going to write savings over here as a one-time way to pay. Pablo has received a one-time grant for $1,000. Well, it says right there, one time. So grants are also usually one time, unless it says it's an annual grant, which it could be. And the last thing here is an annual academic scholarship. That's great for $10,000. That's a lot of money. Annual means it happens every year. Okay. So this scholarship just so happens to be annual and it repeats every year. That means he gets $10,000 every single year he attends the school, which is a lot of money. Last thing, he plans to enroll in the work study program that will pay $12,000 annually. So again, it says annually, so we put it in this category. If it didn't say annually, it might actually be one time, but you have to read it carefully. But in this case, the work study program is annual, which is great. How much will Pablo need to borrow in student loans? So that's the last piece. How much will they have to borrow in student loans in order to attend UC Berkeley for four years? The last thing is, remember, the total cost is four years of college. So make sure you multiply the 30000 per year times four years. Okay? Then you're going to subtract your one-time pieces of payment. So that's like your savings, your grants. If it says one-time scholarship, one-time work-study, yeah, that could be subtracted there too. And then your annuals will be subtracted for every year. So like this scholarship, that's $10,000. That's four years of scholarships for $10,000. So that would be $40,000 total.